Good morning, Quad Cities. We have been seeing a little bit of cloud cover kind of work into the area so far for this morning, but we should quickly see these clouds begin to work out of the area and we'll be left behind with a lot of sunshine for us for today. Highs yesterday, well into the 50s for a lot of us, not going to be the case for today, but we still remain above normal. And normal right now is in the mid 30s, and we haven't been anywhere close to that really for the entire month of February so far. We've been seeing temperatures that we should be seeing well into the month of March. But still, we're going to see temperatures in the 40s, which is still pretty decent for this time of year. Highs will be around 44 degrees for us. Lots of sunshine. Again, still likely going to see a little bit of breeze out there, but that'll slowly calm down as we head through today and going into tonight. Tonight, we'll see some clouds work into the area. Temperatures in the upper 20s. And then we'll continue some pretty decent conditions into Sunday. A mix of sun and clouds. Highs will be in the mid 40s, just less wind. So it's likely going to feel a little bit better for Sunday afternoon. And we stay dry through majority of the upcoming week until we get to Wednesday night. Wednesday night, early Thursday morning, we start to bring in our next chance of precipitation. Right now, it looks like it's going to come in the form of rain showers uh, going into late Wednesday, early Thursday. And by the time we get to Thursday afternoon, it looks like we're going to see drier conditions. So quick system, not really seeing anything too major, at least on the timeline. And we can even see that on the eight day forecast. We could see another opportunity for some precipitation, maybe even working in some light snow showers as we get into Friday of next week. But temperatures are going to start to get a little cooler with it in the mid 30s. For more weather information, you can go on to WQAD.com or download that WQAD News 8 app.